Now let's talk about the alpha, beta and gamma rays in detail. The existence of uh, three different types of radiation such as alpha, beta and gamma can be easily found by the radioactivity experiment. You got your radioactive element in a lead container with your slits, two slits and there is some positive plates and negative plates. Under that if there is no deflection that's gamma rays. If it is positively charged and a small deflection due to high mass that's your alpha particle. And the beta particle negatively charged and large deflection due to low mass is done in a photographic film or luminescent screen. As indicated, a small amount of radium is placed at the bottom of a small hole drilled near a lead box, which is kept in an evacuated chamber. So this is how the radioactivity is happening. This is alpha, beta and gamma. This is electromagnetic poles. So a strong magnetic field is applied at right angles to the plane of the paper and acting inverse. A photographic plate is placed at a short distance above the lead box. Three different traces can be seen on the photographic plate when it is developed. The trace towards left due to positively charged particles that's referred to as alpha particle. And you got your uh, right due to negatively charged particle, they are named as a beta particle. The undeviated trace is due to the neutral radiation which are called as gamma rays. If an electric field is applied, the alpha rays are deflected towards the negative plate. And beta rays towards the positive plate and gamma rays are still undeflected. 